Hi, it's Sarah here. I'm going to show you some exercises for wrists and hands using a squash ball and a lacrosse ball and also a book or a block. So first of all, if you begin up on your fingertips like this and then start to circle your fingers around. So it's a bit like a spider that's, that's, that's drunk. And if you do about 20 circles each way, Next, if you come onto your knuckles and then just start to stir into the mat. If you want to load your wrists, you need to come over the top of the wrist like this, so you'd work in here. You can lift up here, that's more advanced. So again, you'll do about 15 circles each way. Next, if you put your hand in front, other hand on top, and then start to stir around like this. So you're stirring away. And I do about 15 each way. See if you can keep the thumb down as well. So from a different angle, hand down, try and pull it out, and then stir this. So it's a little bit of mobility. Next, this is a bit complicated the first time so you need to get the lacrosse ball to go on this angle here and I'm going to press down so the idea is to spread out these bones in the in the wrist here so I'm going to press like that so from the front it'll look like this from the side it there and I'm going to do about 20 presses then swap to the other side so here pushing into the ball. So next if we come into the squash ball squeeze so you can squeeze the ball like this I do about 20 per side and swap to the other side and the squash ball is really portable so you can just have it around all the time with a squash ball, it helps also to open out this, so see how it's spreading in my hand as I'm squeezing. It also helps to strengthen little muscles in here. So for a really cheap and easy um, shoulder hack, that's squash balls, a really good one. So here, you're going to press the, dangle the wrist off the back of the block. So from this angle, you can see I need to push and I'm going to try and push my hand up like this but stop it with the other hand so over here. So if my hand wasn't on top this would happen. We're just doing a muscle energy technique for the wrist. So it's dangling off the end and I try and push. So the timing would be breathing in, push and then breathing out, stretch a bit more. Same on the other side, wrist stretched off the block or the book here. I'm trying to do this action, but I'm stopping it with my hand. So I'm trying to lift this top hand, stopping it, and then breathe out, stretch a bit more. To finish off, you can stir around like this, or to finish off, wobbly table like this. Thank you very much for watching and more videos like this coming soon.